Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Research and Analysis. My name is Dr. Kamran. In this video, we are going to discuss how to use DeepSeq to change the referencing style. Obviously, it is very easy if you are using any referencing software like Mendeley or EndNote. You can change the referencing style just in clicks. But if you need to change the referencing style in manually, then obviously it's a very hard task, especially you when you have so many references in your document. One strategy which you, we normally use is through Google Scholar. We copy each of the reference and paste in Google Scholar and it provides us the desired referencing style. For instance, we have this document and these references are in Harvard style and we want to change them in APA style. What we can do, we can simply copy each of these references and paste it here in Google Scholar and search. And from here, from the site option, and from here, we can copy APA referencing style and paste it in our document. Obviously, it's a time taking process, especially when we have so many references in our document. But in DeepSeq, you can convert all these references in just one go. Another good point about DeepSeq is it can also provide you the DOI numbers for all your references as required by some of the journals. This is my DeepSeq account. Let me write the prompt convert references from Harvard to APA 7th edition. Copy all these references, inverted commas, paste my all these references and inverted commas close and then plus this arrow. See DeepSeq has changed our references from Harvard to APA and it has also provided us the DOI numbers for all of our references. Now let's just reconfirm if these DOI numbers are correct. Whenever you are using AI for academic purpose, it is always recommended to double check everything. Now let's just open first DOI number. See it is 100% correct. Everything is just same as given here. For second reference, there is no DOI number as this is the reference of a book and books normally do not have the DOI numbers. Now let's just try this DOI. You can see this DOI number is incorrect. Now let's just open next one. This is OK. Then let's open this one. This is also fine. Let's open next one. This is also good. I open next one. Again correct. Then next one. Again incorrect. Open next one. Correct. 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 Problematic. This is also a book reference. And finally this one. This is also correct. See out of 18 DOIs, 15s are still correct, which is quite great. I hope in the coming years we can get 100% correct DOI numbers for all of our references. I hope this video will be helpful to have the understanding about how DeepSea can help you to change the referencing style.